Hi, I am Mohan. Uh, in this video, I am going to explain the syntax for various operations in uh, CNC programming. Okay, in that, the first one is uh, rough turning cycle. For the rough turning cycle, the syntax is G71, U1, U, R, G71, P value, Q value, U value, W value, and F value. Okay, where G71 indicates the rough turning cycle. U is depth of cut, I am going to assume it as 1 mm. R is nothing but retract value, again I am going to assume it as 1 mm. Okay, in the second line, again G71, that is rough turning cycle. P indicates starting block number and Q indicates ending block number. Okay, P value, Q value, we can find out by writing the program. Okay, U is nothing but finishing allowance in X direction, let it be 0.01 mm. W is again finishing allowance in Z axis. Uh, I'm going to assume it as 0.01 again. Okay, F is feed value. That is, I'm going to assume it as 25 mm per revolution. Okay. Next, the for syntax for finishing cycle is G70, P value, Q value, and F value. Where P and P value is a starting block. Uh, Q value is ending block in a program. Uh, F is a feed rate. Again, I'm going to assume it as a 20 mm per revolution. Okay, third one is a grooving cycle. For the grooving cycle, the syntax is a G75, R value. In the second line, G75, X value, Z value, P value, Q and F. Okay, G75 is nothing but grooving cycle. R, R is a retract value. Here, I'm going to assume it as 1 mm. Or you can assume 2 mm or 3 mm also. Okay, in the second line again, G75 uh, is nothing but grooving cycle. Okay, X is the diameter of groove. By looking at the geometry given, we can determine the value of X. Okay, Z is the width of the groove. Again, by geometry, uh, we can determine the value of Z. Okay, P is the pecking increment along X axis, and Q is the stepping distance along Z axis. But remember, both P value and Q value should be substituting microns. Therefore, I'm going to assume P value as 100 mm, Q value as 150 mm. Okay, then F is again feed rate. I'm going to assume it as 20 mm. Uh, if you want, you can assume, assume different feed rate also. Okay, the next one is a thread, a external threading cycle. The syntax for external threading cycle is G76. Uh, is nothing but threading cycle. P, P followed by six digit. There, the first and second digit indicate number of pauses. Third and fourth digit indicate chamfer angle. Fifth and sixth digit indicate thread angle. Okay, in this uh, problem, I'm going to assume the p-value as 06, 01, and 60, where 06 is the number of pauses, that is 6 pauses. And I'm going to assume chamfer angle as 1 degree and thread angle as 60 degree. Next, we have Q. Q is nothing but minimum de depth of cut and again we have to substitute Q in terms of microns therefore I'm going to assume it as 100 microns then R is again uh, finishing allowance I'm going to assume it as 0.1 mm okay, in the second line again G76 that is threading cycle X is nothing but core diameter uh, we have formula to determine core diameter that is uh, major diameter minus 2p Okay, major diameter we will get from the geometry given in the question minus 2p where p is height of thread in microns but you have sorry height of thread and we have to substitute the value of p in mm okay next uh, z z is nothing but uh, z axis coordinate up to which thread must be cut again z value can be calculated by looking at the diagram or the geometry given then we have p here p is not pitch okay p is nothing but height of thread in microns the formula to calculate P is uh, P is pitch into 0 0.61343. Pitch will be given in the question. Okay, next we have Q. Q is nothing but maximum depth of cut in microns. I'm going to assume it as uh, 150 mm. Next we have F. Okay, please remember here F is not feed rate. Okay, F is nothing but a pitch of thread. Okay, it will be given in the question. Okay, then next we have facing cycle. For the facing cycle, the syntax is uh, G72, W value, R value. In the next uh, line, G72, P value, Q value, U value, W value, and F value. 
again G72 is facing cycle WO is the depth of cut I'm going to assume it as 0.1 mm if you want you can change the value R is retract value again I'm going to assume it as 1 mm in the second line again G72 G72 is the facing cycle P is the starting block number and Q is ending block number both these values can be determined by writing the pro after writing the program and U is the finishing allowance in X direction again I'm going to assume it as 0.01 mm W is again finishing allowance in Z axis I'm going to assume it as 0.01 mm okay F is the feed rate okay let it be 25 mm okay these are the syntaxes for uh, rough turning cycle, finishing cycle, grooving cycle, external threading cycle and facing cycle. If you know these syntaxes, we can easily write the program for uh, given geometry. Thank you.